You guys ready for the latest and greatest? Here it is, today's special, brought to you by, I don't even know. I, don't, I got nobody yet. Why don't you guys give me some sponsors? Budweiser, Bud Light, Bigelow. We'll pick something good. So, Diesel Doctor has got something for you today. Another cool one, lady, for the bunk here for So, right off the bat, Drain that coolant. Always, always draining coolant, always draining oil. Man, we are getting dirty. I don't know. I don't even know why anymore. I think we need to make more money. If you got any ideas, you let me know. I already tried the stage thing. It didn't work out. Apparently, follically challenged people don't bring in a lot of money. You got an idea, you let me know. So here we are inside the bunk. On the left-hand side of the bunk, you open up this lower cover. You take out this carpet, take out the carpet, and you'll see the heater core cover. That sucker right there needs to be cut out with a razor blade. So if my flashlight would work with me. Where's my razor blade? While the coolant's draining, I like to come over here and just do a couple passes, make sure it's nice and easy. The new one will be bolted in see it does slide pretty easy nice sharp blade I prefer rusty just in case anything happens rusty always works better that is of course if you got your tetanus shot if you don't well you better go get it oh there it is a little pocket screwdriver pop that bad boy up oh hello there you are there it is come on come on come on by the way the coolant is extremely hot right now so lucky me right, we'll go along the side kind of clean it up a little bit make sure there's nothing kind of sticking that way the new one comes in really easy Beautiful. Yeah, we're looking at a nice clean cover. That's gonna come right out once we take off the lower hoses. So, on the side of the truck, I'm gonna look under here. Let's take a look at these hoses. Looks like the hoses have both been replaced. Someone failed to see that the heater core was actually leaking. Common issue. People just think this is the issue, but it isn't. And you can see, it's all wet up there. What? Their loss, my gain. Oh, the look, it's leaking now too, how nice. We're gonna go ahead and remove these hoses. We're not gonna reuse them. We're gonna get new ones, just because that's how I like to do things. Got my hoses right there, we're gonna get new clamps too. So with these, loosen them up, cut them out, drop this down a little bit, and we make a little bit of a mess. Okay, so what I just did was I went ahead and cut the hoses. I went ahead and looped them up so it's nice and easy to get out of the hard pipe. I got my new clamps. What we got right here is a brand new heater core. New cover. And I gotta put the seal on in this groove right there all the way around. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, so this guy right here, this is my vacuum, uh, my vacuum system tool. I'm just gonna put the system under a vacuum. So I got the coolant drain. Whatever is in my cassette line going back to the bunk is all gonna come back here. That way I can make somewhat of a little less mess over there. Try to keep things a little neater. So, we're gonna put this thing under a vacuum. Make sure the hoses kinda collapse. Oh, there it goes, there it goes. Now I'm ready to take off these clamps. Under here. Go ahead, take those off, pull the lines down. There it is, the hose is off. Now I can just take this, put it straight up. I can take it out from the cab, put the other one in, do everything in reverse. So there we go, I just took out that one. As you can see, it was leaking pretty bad. Here is the new one going in. Let's 
slap and tiggle goes right in there. As for the new cover, just a little bit of a beating and it gets bol bolted in. Not where I wanted to spend my day in the bunk of another man's truck. But I follow the money, right? Oh, done. Now we can get that carpet back on, cover closed, and we'll be good. All right, so while I'm here, we can clean these off. Get my new clamps on. Put them right where I want them. Clamps are on, she's beautiful now. Go ahead and turn this off. And made a little bit of a mess. That's all right. All right, so right now we're gonna pull the cooling system back up. Then we're gonna pressure test it and make sure there's no more leaks. All right, cooling is in there. System is under pressure. Still being an issue. Otherwise, we're good. 